We're headed to the head of the bicycle trail. You see the bike route sign. And if you look carefully past the uh, entrance to the bike routes, you'll see that bicycle, the bicycles are prohibited sign. Substandard width between the bollards. We're headed down the old Highway 3 right-of-way here. And the path is very straight and rather boring for the first couple of miles. So I'm probably not going to bother to tape all of this. path is extra wide in this segment here. We're going slightly uphill. Speed is currently 9 miles an hour. I seem to recollect, I seem to recollect that there were picnic tables at these wide spots in the trail at one point. Here's a downhill section. Still on Highway 3, Gold Corridor. Here's a crack and a picnic table, as I remembered from a few years ago. I think that was a drainage swale. Here's another wide spot, but with no picnic table. This northern section of the trail is moderately uphill southbound. Good afternoon. Those were the only bicyclists I've seen on this section. We're now approaching the old Highway 3 bridge. Nice scenery off there. Down there you see the bridge. We're going to go under that if you can believe it. Now the question is, where does the trail go from here? You can't see. We also have the uh, bollards. Here's where the trail is. This is the chute. It is incredibly steep. Speed limit 20. Come out from behind the trees. And here we are. Can't 
see around the corner. Rock pile on the right to fall into. Oh, potholes. This is sort of amazing. Yeah. Challenging for a cyclist like me. Perhaps deadly for someone less skillful. Now we're climbing. Highways up there. This is steep to get back up to highway level from under that bridge. Here come some pedestrians. Pretty decent pedestrian trail. <laughs> the bridge was at mile 1.8. We're now at mile 2.5, approaching an underpass. I think this is where it stops climbing. This is Route 18. Notice the path down from Route 18. Highways on our left, still. Bicyclists ahead. Thank you. Yeah. Passing on your left. Passing on your left. Passing on your left. the Cannon Mountain Tramway. We're approaching the Cannon Mountain parking lots. There's a, there's a split in the path here. I'm not sure what that other branch does. I haven't done that before, so I'm going to go look.
Notice the sign, I have a picture of that sign. I believe this one goes around the parking lot, while the other one goes through it. Yeah. But there's no sign indicating which way to go. Excuse me, where does this go? Oh. Yeah. That's the branch to the parking lot. This is the branch that goes around the parking lot. Been here before. the old highway alignment. I want to go back and have a look at the other route. Catch the design of this bollard. It started out as an I-beam, then a wooden post was put on top of it. The reflectorized material. Same thing on the other side. This is the other branch of the bicycle trail headed into the parking lot. This is where I took pictures years ago. Blind corner there. Nasty dollar that hasn't been extended. We passed the ski museum. There's the tramway. So we're headed down to where we were before, where the trail crossed this road. Looking at it this way, this is the way a lot of people will come when they're getting their cars off. Yeah, or their bikes off their cars when they're getting their bikes off their cars. What was I saying? Curb, bollard, not an easy turn to negotiate, especially if you're pulling a kid trailer like the one we saw back there. Heads up! 
kid, watch it, please. back to the, the road. Jail actually is on a road here a little bit. There's the famous bike walk zone. Why do we have to walk our bikes here? This is one of the nicest part of the, uh, parts of the why do we have to walk our bikes here? It's one of the nicest parts of the trail, but not for long. Okay, I'm going to take a little detour off the bike route down to the viewing area where the old man used to be. Down by the pond. This is as far as the trail goes. Heads up! Watch out, please. Yeah. Pedestrians will do all kinds of things besides pay attention. Behind you! Behind you! Okay. Ooh, ooh, some moguls. We turn into the tunnel from the right, and it's like this. Entering the tunnel from the left. Note the thoughtfully positioned park bench. The slippery wooden culvert cover and the fence that doesn't bear relationship to leaning of bicycles. Let's look at this from the other end, too. This is where I took a still photo a while ago, a few years ago. Not much has changed. viewing area on the east side of the highway. Path turns into a sidewalk. Because that's deadly. as crowded as it was last time. So there isn't any old man to view anymore.
and down. Seventeen miles an hour. Up again. Behind you, on your left. Well, it is a one lane bridge when you're following one of them, that's for sure. The lesser shoot. Comes a sidewalk in the door zone. Notice the signs are different now. Another bollard. Everything okay here? Oh, yes. <laughs> Thank you. Just be careful on those downhills. They're wicked. Nineteen miles an hour, a big bump in the middle of the path. So it looks as though it's been pay, repaved sometime fairly recently. Won't stand up to the winters. Okay. There's where we make some time. That's the sign. Curve sharp. But I have brakes. So 
go going 14 miles an hour here. Afternoon. I think he had the dog on the leash. Okay, we're approaching the second parking place on the left side of the highway. Another bollard. Parking spaces right adjacent to the trail so you can't see. And what's this? How have they signed this? If you're going this way, it's supposed to be a bike lane, although it's not marked bike lane on this side, bike route. Now if we turn around, and we will and have a look at the other side of this, headed north, we're now headed south, and see how they've designated it. So I'm turning around, going back to the north, This is the way you've got to go. I don't see any signs yet. It may be videoed here by local police or by me. Well, I don't see any signs facing the other way. Interesting. But note that weird arrow would seem to indicate that you're supposed to be on the left side. See this? And then that over there. Very odd. Okay. But there's only a bike lane designated on one side. Perhaps the idea is to keep traffic on one side or parking on, to, perhaps the idea is to keep parking on one side so that there's enough room for bicycles and motor vehicles to share at least one lane. But there's no bike lane stripe. Okay. Another bollard. That one's new. The wooden part is new. Good afternoon. Approaching another bridge. tree fell when no one was here, or we hope it did. Kamakawasa River on our right. 
babbling sound, rushing sounds you hear. that way. Another bridge. And yet another bridge. Behind you, please keep right. Oh, they'll keep right. Thank you. Right. Should we go have a look at the basin? I don't think so. Bike walks zone. Let's see why. There are all these pedestrians. On the other hand, I have control over my bike, unlike many. Behind you, please pay attention. Behind you. Heads up!
behind you. Coasting the whole way here. It's downhill from north to south, most of the way south of Cannon Mountain. Wow. Heads up. Behind you. Hi. Now it's a really steep uphill for a little bit. It's up and down, up and down, up and down. I'm going to pull off and give my sweetie a phone call. I am maybe a mile north of where you are right now. Okay, well, I'll see you when I get there. Okay. Bye. Bye. Cresting the hill looks like we'll be going back downhill now. Wow. And uphill again. There's a big glacial rock. Afternoon. Wow. 
Whoa. Frost heaves. The root heaves. Thank oh you. Oh my god! What is that? Electric? What is it? Is what electric? Your bike? No, no, my bike isn't electric. I'm just a big, strong guy. Well, what's this? What's what? That. That's a handlebar bag, and you are now being videotaped. See the thing on top of my head? That's a video camera. That's so cool. Well, I'm How just can taking. How you try to videotape me? Hmm? How can you videotaping me? Because you asked about my bike. Oh. Hi. I say hi, Mom, but I don't know if your mom will ever see it. <laughs> okay, take care, guys. I gotta go, go down to the parking lot and meet my wife and drive on. Hi. Have a good day. Um, okay, we're going to pass those kids again because I backed up a little bit to look at this crossing. This is a crossing of a very minor road. Um, the path gets the stop signs. Here I come again! Wave the checkered flag! Okay, let's see what they've figured out for how to get the bicyclists through here. Heads up! Heads up, please! So you go around on the sidewalk and then they let you out into the road here. So I'll take you down to route Three, and then we'll come back in and see how that works. This is Route 3. Not much traffic on it, which isn't surprising because Route 93 goes next to it. Going the other way. Notice Please keep right. Notice there is no instruction as to where the bike trail is. Because of course, oh now there is, but not as you enter the parking lot. But no, 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 that says buses, motorcycles, trailers. So how do you get to the bike trail in this parking lot? I'm stopping, you go. See what I mean? Actually, the bike trail is over here. You may be videotaped. It's on the left side over there. You're supposed to get over there on the sidewalk. There's no sign indicating that. I don't like getting on the sidewalk. I don't like crossing to the left side of the road into oncoming traffic. So I'm just riding around the parking lot. I'm surprised they let people park right here. But so here's the parking lot. Up there is the entrance to the bike trail. little bike rack over there. There's no curb ramp up here directly from the parking lot. 
the only official way out of here or into here is by that sidewalk on the left side with no sign. Okay, now let's look for our car.